I think we heard from the mayor now that the budget has kind of passed, it will in a couple of weeks, um, and we are finally focusing on service and those core issues of building and housing and safety. I mean, that is what resonates across every corner of the city. I heard the same old speech that we've heard for the last 12 years, this is the problem. They are only talking, they are only talking, I'm actually doing. The proof is in the pudding. Our streets aren't safer, our neighborhoods aren't safer, our roads aren't better, and our schools still have a long way to go. Uh, the fact that he's uh, focused in on dealing with the trauma that many of our young people uh, face in our neighborhoods. Uh, safety is a concern, but it's, that safety is real for some people. Uh, there is a level of violence that occurs and seems to be metastasized in some neighborhoods, especially around young people, and being able to not only uh, address it with the police in a kinetic way, but also try to understand the root causes and try to deal with them with multiple different partners. The mayor has this outline of four or five big ideas that he that he spoke about today but I think there could be more I guess you know we've got a lot of talent both at the city and then in our partners so I'd love to add for example as you know open data and civic technology and you know they're, they're doing the quality and performance management but I'd like to have him understand and say more. What can we do to make our children have normal childhoods, they have great ed educational opportunities? And so I'm really looking forward to how we um, integrate uh, all of our services uh, through the, uh, the new office and, and aligning uh, the various departments of uh, law enforcement, education, and other things, and, and, and ensuring that our children are all right. I have spent the last eight years with Mayor Jackson, calling for him to treat our problems of our neighborhoods with an urgency, to go and get the private sector to respond to the crime, to get our private sector to respond to the poverty. Now he says it today, but there's a frustration of where you've been.